So I was traveling the other day and I ran into a little problem. Normally I take my GPS with me, but I didn't this time. Luckily I have an iPhone 4 that has the new maps, so I decided to use that instead. Here's the problem I ran into though. Set up my maps like I normally would. Set it here. And you can see what happens. Road to South Nelson Drive. Head west on Freedom Way. Here we're looking at the gear shift of my car. There's a couple options that we have to possibly uh, mount a device or something that would hold the iPhone in place. First of all, we have this uh, piece up front. Uh, we could create another part that's it's, it's roughly the same size as that that would mount in here, uh, and but would maybe provide a support for the iPhone. The only problem with this is it's a little bit uh, flat. So if we mount something too high and too heavy, it's going to have to be uh, have a tendency to tip forward. We may want to uh, augment the device a little bit so that it has something in the back that fits in here or in this other level. Uh, this would keep it from um, uh, tipping forward. Another idea is to look down a little bit closer here. We have a uh, pocket that comes out and we could find a device that fits in here. Now th this is a little nicer because it's deeper and it gives better support for the iPhone. Um, we could also mount something up higher here so that the, the, the uh, uh, driver is able to see and maybe twist it a little bit so that they're able to see uh, more clearly.